Could you just turn that down a bit, please? Well, I'm trying to con have volume control. Yeah. I did some research last night. Yes. On golden doodles. Oh God. And they don't shed. They're hypoallergenic. No, They're no. really, really, really. Listen, cute. Hen. Why, Dad? We can't have a dog because, as I've said before, all dogs. But Think of another pet. You know, you could have a, a cat or a hamster or a, I don't know what kids have these days. Have a have a vampire bat. <laughs> Is that a promise? Yes, that is a promise. Like the, the promise of uh, Road Trip 2? Just you and me? That's a low blow. That will happen. Will that it? will happen. Shit, my violin! Well, your dad does, which is very uh -huh. sweet. Which reminds me we have dinner with him next Thursday. Right, so I have Ridden and your dad in the same week. I'm just the luckiest girl in New York. <laughs> Don't you like Reardon? Would you like Reardon? You, you like your school? Yeah. Hey. And I love it. Go on, kiss your mom. We have to no. go. No, I'm not kissing you. Let me do it. We need to clean this up. I'm not doing it. Because I heard nothing. Uh, no, I practice. Really? Yeah, I swear. Do you know, he doesn't even think I'm any good, Mr. Rosenbaum. He actually said that, did he? Well, no, it's not that he says it. It just, he used to say a lot more good stuff. I mean, sometimes with the looks he gives me, like, I think he wants me to quit. Because somewhere deep down in the, in the bowels of your teenage psyche, you actually want to give it up. I don't want to give up. I love violin. OK, well, that's great. Well, you can be joyless. Thank you, pardon? Yeah, you can be joyless when you're, when you're stressed. Lately. No, I'm stressed about being stressed, so thank you very much. You're welcome. Look, you don't, you don't play your violin for Rosenbaum anyway. You owe him your respect and your hard work, but in the end... Got it. Great. And you're brilliant, OK? So fuck Rosenbaum. I'm telling Mom you said that. Take your violin and shove it up his Rosenbaum cheeks, OK? Dad. Henry? Uh-huh. Come on. Have you eaten? Yeah. We got to go. Quick! Put yeah. those books away. OK. Mom. I don't think Dad is actually allergic to dogs. I think he's just allergic. He would never want me to tell you he was actually your age. Really? Mm-hmm. I mean, it was very traumatic for him. And it was actually made worse because his parents. Well, what kind of dog? That's what I know. Anyway, I honestly don't think he's ever gotten over it. Quick, put everything away, would you? Let's go. Put your coat on. It's freezing outside. All right. Uh, Henry. Hmm? What, what's going on? Um, I'm just talking to these men. Can you go to your room and I'll, um, I'll make you a snack. Is everything okay? Yes. Yep. Everything. And, um, I'll be right there. Okay. Good. Go on. <laughs> Good. Thank you. All right, thanks. Henry, are they here for the murder? Oh, I, I saw it on my phone. Really? Yeah. They mentioned Reardon. Did you, um, did you know the boy? I don't think so. Thank you. Kind of scary, huh? Did the father do it? It's it's too soon to know. Did you know her? Uh, Mom, who got? Did you know her? <laughs> Was she nice? Did you hear from Dad today at all? Uh, not since this morning when he left. Yeah, he came in to say goodbye. I think he just said bye, and then... And then he kissed me on the forehead. And, and left. I was half asleep. Probably that he loved me. Say goodbye? Doesn't he usually say goodbye the night before? Um... Mom, Mom you're acting strange. Well, it's, it's just, I... I... I haven't heard from him all day. You left his phone? Mm-hmm. Do you know his code? No. 
He seemed like dad. Maybe he told you that he loved you and then he left? What's going on? Um, nothing. It, it, it's nothing. Mom. Oh, God. What? You scared me. Don't do that. I said, Mom, what's wrong with you? I don't know where your father is. He's not returning calls. He's not returning my emails. Nothing. And it doesn't make any sense. Is it possible that he just doesn't have internet? He's at a medical conference, Henry. He has internet. All right. So he's usually terrible about checking in, right? You guys fight about it all the time. And he usually has those dinners after the conference. If he's at the dinner, but he, if he doesn't have his phone, then how is he going to communicate with you? Or maybe he's on a plane. Because he did say he might get back earlier. Somebody tried to call him, heard your voice, thought wrong number, and hung up. Live in front of the power. Is this because of the dead mom? Grace. Please. Grace. Oh, so be I. You know, any techniques you could recommend? I'm gonna head in. Sure. Is he back yet? What? Dad, is he back yet? No. What? Hey, Henry. Hey, Grandpa. Them has made some penny matter now, especially for you. Several witnesses Good morning, Henry. Mrs. Alves as visibly Good morning, upset. Grandpa. No other party goers dispute that account. Early suspicion was on the victim's husband, but we're now learning. Do the police think he killed her? Why did they take you into the police station? Because he knew her. He was her child's doctor. And it's not a crime to know somebody. No, no, it's not. So they think you killed her. Hi, what was that? Morning, sir. Did you head up to class? No? Huh? Yes, sir. Are you okay? Yeah. You sure? No, I'm fine. Henry, you scared me. Mom, I don't want to be here. I know, but we're here. For how long? For as long as it takes. That's not an answer. We'll go back when things When are they over. what? When they what? Come on, Go Henry. back to normal? R by running away. That's bullshit, Mom. There's no hiding. Turn it off. What? <sighs> he looks scared. Dad.
be easy. Keep saying that. Hey, come Mom. on. Hey, Mom. Put it down. Mom. Mom. I'll be fine. Okay? You kill her. You're fucking her. So you don't love mommy. And I let that be a reason to lose my strength of character. And then, after everything. Why did you run? We're never gonna be a family again. Come here. Come here. Hey, no touching. Let's go. It's okay. Um. Hi. I'm I'm sorry. Then why am I here? I would just like to know what was said. What was said? Hi was said by me. Miguel didn't say anything. Well, after I said sorry. I bumped into him by accident. So I said sorry. I said sorry out of courtesy. My locker. This was a vicious murder. The woman's head was nearly liquefied. It's all right. Are you okay? Uh, are you... Hey. And touch my finger. Oh, please, really? Come on. And now you know this. And... Yeah, sure. Yeah, I I like it. Most kids at Reardon want to play the drums. I, I like the violin, because it's different. Who did? How you doing, Henry? Good, thanks, sir. Yeah? He then fled the scene and went into a... doing sitting what is it i couldn't sleep in my bed are you thinking about it all yeah what is it what's wrong something's wrong i can tell no no i'm fine At school. Maybe Miguel's father. Maybe they found out. And maybe if I told to you, no. then they wouldn't have. Henry, you, you, can't you can't say that. You can't. Can. No, but mom, I saw them. They weren't doing anything. I mean, they weren't kissing or anything, but. But I just knew when 
I saw them. I knew. And... He... But... I just... I felt like he trusted me. They're saying, like, can't make the prosecutor feel good having your whole case ride. Just turn it off. Thank you. No, she was going to do that. And you're okay being a suspect. Just look at Mr. Alves. And they didn't. I think we're going to win last night. Oh. If we can survive this trial, I think this family can survive. All right. Don't you? I want to talk about it now. Mm -hmm. We can still be a family. We can even get a dog, finally. I'll take care of it, so you won't have to worry about what happened before. Mom told me about the dog thing. About your family blaming you. Mom, what did I say? It's all right, Mom. Just wait here. the dishwasher to protect you yeah when just after we got to the beach house twice well yeah, of course henry could be arrested for obstruction of justice they can blame henry add to that they will traumatize the shit out of him it is my advice all right what What should I do with it? That is not an answer. Grace. Go to your room. Fuck you. You're accusing me of doing this. I fucking heard you! You heard. And it was my mind. And I'm under siege. Everyone seems to think I did this thing and I didn't. You blamed me. I love you. Henry. Yeah. Huh? I know how close you and your dad are. Dad created this. Do you hope for that? You are answering a question with a question again. Yeah. But I'd like you to answer first. Hope for that. <laughs> Further betting on the trial's outcome, as Dr. Fraser's conviction seems all but assured. Magical mystery tour. It's, it's the long promised road trip, too. I just thought, you know, it'd be our last chance to do it. Dad, come on, we can't go on a road trip come right on, now. Come on, come on, come on, sit back, relax, enjoy yourself, sing a song. Fried clams? We can't go get fried clams. You need to pull over and let Dad, clam Jesus. should be so wide up. Sorry. You murdered a person, Dad. It's all right. It's all right. It's okay. Dad, stop. Yeah, in a minute. Stop in a minute. the car to stop. You have to pull over and let me out, Dad. 
Dad, please, please. Every last second. Dad, come on. Come on, you can't do this. It's going to make it worse. Shut up! Please. Dad, what the fuck are you doing? Dad, Dad, Dad. Dad! Dad! Just get back in the car. I love you. No. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Grace, I'm sorry. All right, Henry. Ready.